Kelsey and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is actually going to be kind of something a little different. It is going to be my holiday wish list. Um, this video is not going to be like intangible things. That list is really long but this is just going to be a list of tangible things that are on my wish list that would just be maybe something fun to give ideas to others. Um, I am a mom. I do have a house and I have kids so that's where I'm coming from making this list um, but I am just a person so my first little section is going to be like household items that I would like um, and then my last little um, section will be like possibly like fashion wise things I would like. The first thing I would like house wise that is kind of actually an appliance is of course an air fryer everyone a couple years ago was wanting air fryers and i still haven't ever had an air fryer but i would love one of those because i feel like it would make it really easy um for like doing cooking and stuff so i would love an air fryer another appliance like thing i guess it's an appliance um whatever is a steam mop i would love a steam mop i said i feel like such an adult whatever the items on my list were things like a steam mop but I would love one because we do have like tile and hardwood downstairs and it would just make cleaning so much easier with the kids to have a steam mop so I'd love a steam mop. The next thing is kind of a decoration item. Um, last year or the year before something like that I got me a live plant um, and it did not work out. Um, the cat and the children destroyed it so I would love to get a fake fiddly fig. They have them kind of all over the place, but the ones I've found that I like that look the most real to me are the ones from QVC. I would love a big five foot one for my living room. That would just be awesome. But another random thing is I would like velvet hangers. I've never had hangers that match or anything like that, but I'm getting ready to redo my closet and I would love to have all the same hangers and have them be the velvet hangers that like hold them nicely so i would love velvet hangers and honestly these could be from anywhere um i really do think i like the black ones but that's what i would like is some velvet hangers um the last thing on my home items list i could always use like a blanket or anything honestly like pillows whatever but my next item is a rug um i've been looking everywhere for a rug that isn't so expensive I do have an older dog she actually will be eight tomorrow and she's eight but she's like an older eight um we're pretty sure she's had like stroke in her time all kinds of stuff she's getting up there and so sometimes certain times especially in the winter when she has really bad her arthritis is, starts to act up really bad um she has more accidents in the house because also then it makes it harder to, for her to get to the bathroom so we had a rug and yeah I was, so I've been trying to find a cheaper rug that I could use for now that eventually could probably be thrown away and I found one at five below and it's ten dollars and it's like a rug that would go up under our kitchen table and it's blue it would look so pretty in the kitchen but that is what I would love is this little ten dollar rug um it's not expensive I really like one of those to go in my kitchen just to make it a little nicer just to kind of cozy it up in there because it is kind of chilly in there and we do have our homeschool area in there so that would be nice to have a rug um and so the next little part of my list will be fashion items i am not a fashionista person um, i'm very simple very plain jane i could always use some warm socks christmas socks are like one of my collector items i guess um so i always love a good christmas sock but these are different items that than just like the average anything you could get um so one of them is a pair of slippers but i want a pair of slippers that have a hard bottom um that are also nice and fuzzy and warm because my floor in my house is really cold so i would like that but i found a couple different ones that i really liked so honestly any of them would be good but the ones i really loved were the jessica simpson ones that they sell at belk and those were nice and fuzzy looking so that is the slippers that i really like and then another thing we are now officially out of the needing to take diaper bags around stage um so i'm really discovering like my pocketbooks and stuff and i really hardly have any 
Um, but something I would love is a new pocketbook. And the one I've been looking at that I could not bring myself to spend the money on right now or probably any time in the future, um, I'd probably find something a little cheaper somewhere else. I love the concept of this this company. Um, they are a backpack. They're a handmade purse, leather. Like They use like leather and they make like wallets and bags. But the company is called in blue handmade and it's in located in Asheville and what they do is for every bag they sell um especially since the pandemic has happened they will provide meals with Feeding America so I just think that is awesome the one I would love is the crossbody one that could also be a backpack because even though we're out of the um, diaper bag stage I would look I like being hands-free because I have three little kids so that would be great is I would love that's on my wish list not that I would ever probably get it because it is really expensive um, and I can't really afford that and I know most of the time the people who are shopping for me don't have that much of a budget because there's so many people um, but that would be something so cool is to get that bag um, I've also looked at other ones but they're more like diaper bag realm and I'm out of the diaper bag so I wanted to look at something that would just be nicer and just for me um, but that would be like my like wish list thing that probably won't happen. But I would love to get a new pocketbook and that's the style I really like. So that is all I have for this little shopping wish list for Christmas. Um, I'm probably never going to get uh, parts of them. But that is it. Oh, I forgot my wall decor. That is something that I'm probably going to hopefully get is wall decor. I forgot that in my home to my home area. But there are so many that I want right now. I want a cow, a long, like the Highland cows for, I want one for my bedroom that's a Highland cow. And then I want a big horse canvas. I've seen a couple different ones. There's one at um, Big Lots I kind of like. And there's other ones like I've seen other places. So I'm not sure which one I'd want the most. But a horse painting of some sort for the living room. And then I would also, there are these cute deers at ikea that i've looked at multiple times i would love for my stairway but yeah that's some random things i forgot but yes wall decor is a good thing too but that is all i have for this video if you did enjoy it give it a thumbs up if it gave you any ideas um then comment below what your favorite item was that i kind of showed i know i didn't have any of these items here to show because it's my actual wish list because i don't have any of these things but if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and I will see y'all tomorrow. Bye.